Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my week 31 update of my fitness journey. Whew, man, this was a week. So like normal, I'm just going to go through what I did this week, give you guys some updates, and then we are going to show you the progress photos. So starting off on Saturday, I actually didn't work out. Surprise, surprise. I never work out on Saturdays, but I was a little bit more physically active because I had a work event I was at a virtual event, so I was like standing and help setting up like cameras and taking down equipment and everything. And I also had a YouTube day, so I basically edited videos. Sunday, I did the 15 minute body workout by Pamela. It's really intense. I really suggest that one if you want to get a quick workout in. And then I also did the 10 minute six pack workout, and I really like that one as well. It's really fun. Um, and I really didn't feel like working out on Sunday, but I pushed myself and I just did and that is why I only did two workouts, but that's okay. Monday, I did the 20 minute intense workout by Pamela Reef as well as her upper body workout. It's about 10 minutes and her 10 minutes booty workout. This is basically my favorite, favorite workout plan so far. Um, I love Pamela Reef. Like overall, I think she's my favorite. She's so challenging and I also really like her accent. Tuesdays, I don't work out, so there is no footage there. And then moving on to Wednesday. Wednesday is normally my easier day because it's in the middle of the week and everything, but I actually went hardcore on Wednesday and I switched Friday and Wednesday's workouts. So on Wednesday, I did the 20 minute full body workout, the 10 minute waist, the trained waist workout. I did the 15 minute thigh workout. That one kills me every time and then the 10 minute water bottle arm, toned arm workout. I love that one. Thursday, I actually worked out yesterday. That's why I'm coming to you with nice, clean hair today. And it's like all down and I'm pretty cozy because I worked out yesterday. So yesterday, Thursday, I did the Jason Drulo hit workout, super hardcore, the 15 minute six pack ab workout. And then I also did the 12 minute happy sweat dance workout. I only did those three on Thursday because that's what I normally do on Wednesday, if that makes sense. So I just kind of swapped everything because I know on Thursday I do not want to work out, but because of my schedule and everything, I just had to rearrange a few things. So it was a little bit of an off week, but that's okay. Moving on to the updates. Don't really have a lot of updates, but I'm gonna say food wise, it was a terrible week because you know, I'm having Starbucks now. I had McDonald's yesterday for dinner. It was so bad guys. So I normally do teriyaki Tuesday, but it was a little late on Tuesday when I got home from a work thing. And honestly, it was just too late and I didn't want to have that many carbs. So I was like, oh, let's just do it on Thursday. Of course, the Panda Express we go to is a little bit of a mess. All right. So they were out of teriyaki chicken. I know that's, it's a little silly and I didn't want to go all Karen, but it's not the first time that this sort of thing has happened. It's probably like the fourth time. Yes, I guess I sound like a Karen, but like, come on. I mean, one time they were out of white rice. Like, oh, I just, Anyway, I don't know what day it was, but we also had Hooters and the Hooters wings are so good. And I also had French fries. Those are so good. After Wednesday's workout and still to today, my arms and shoulders have been super, super sore. So I don't know really what caused that, but I don't know. I just found that after my Wednesday workout, my shoulders slash arms were super sore after I did the water bottle workout and I don't know, maybe it's just because I haven't been working out my arms as much, who knows? Another update I wanted to bring you is who am I trying next for workouts? I loved and I checked out everyone that you guys have suggested to me. Some of them just, I wasn't really feeling their vibe. Like I just didn't really like their personalities. No offense, like, I mean, that's the beauty of the internet. Like there's a lot of workout gurus and bloggers, vloggers out there so we can all appreciate one another and the differences. But some of the ones that you guys suggested to me, I was like, eh, I'm just not feeling it. Um, like the way they come off across on camera and I have to genuinely like or feel motivated by the person I'm doing their workouts or else it'll just become like unmotivating. And I don't like the super like, oh my 
my gosh, guys, like kind of, we're so excited to work out. Like who is that excited to work out? Like not really me. I mean, I like working out, but we don't have to be like that. You know what I'm saying? I also don't like the people who completely talk through the workout. Like, and now make sure your elbow and me match together. Like, I don't really like that. I, I prefer the music, the timer, and then the just focusing on the workout. I don't really like the talking so much back and forth. Um, that's just a personal preference. But the person that I found, and I cannot wait to try her workouts, is San Valette, Sani, Sani? She also does videos with this girl named Sammy. I know their names are like super similar, but San, San, Sani, oh my gosh, this is terrible. Her last name is Loette. I think she's from a different country. I don't even know. I haven't done a ton of research, but I found her channel through my friend Heather's video about all the workout vloggers she tried out. So San Valette, I believe is how you pronounce her name. I'm trying her workouts along with um, probably a couple of her friend Sammy's workouts. They're kind of like workout gurus together. So, I mean, I might try some of theirs. If you guys are wondering what my favorite Pamela Reef workouts are, I have a whole playlist. So go to my playlist sections on this channel and you will see the 14 videos I love from Pamela. If you guys have tried Sani Vallette's workouts, let me know down below. Um, I think she was like a Victoria's Secret angel model, which was like super cool. Um, but let's move on to my photos. So on the left is Alex last week and on the right is Alex this week. And then here is the side version of that. And I cannot believe I actually look pretty good for eating like total crap this week. So I'm not complaining whatsoever. And then moving on to pre-workout Alex. On the left is pre-workout Alex and on the right is current Alex. And here is the side view of that. Honestly, I can't believe the way I look and feel after not having the best diet this week. But as I've learned, Food doesn't impact my body as much when I'm working out consistently, regularly and everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Question of the day, beach or pool? I would have to say pool. I don't know why, I just like the pool better. Anyway, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.